brand new Mercedes G63 AMG. So let's try to take a look at this car. It's a matte black finish. Lights here. The car is noticeably wider in real person. Let's look into the trunk. Okay, so you can see this incredible red stitching on this black leather right here. New carpet, carpets all around here, so back of the car is definitely improved from the previous generation. Alcantara headliner and you can see the interior right through here as well. Alright, so let's close the trunk. Still makes the proper still makes the proper noises. Black and the red AMG wheels. Pretty interesting detail also is the red stripe right here. Even though that's just a sticker. AMG V8 bar turbo. You can see the new front indicators, they actually go down if you hit a pedestrian. In my opinion though, they are too big in the round. I did like Design of the old indicators, the simple small ones weigh more. So Mercedes designed the new headlights with these round DLRs around the projector. And even though I have to say that it looks pretty bad on photos and on videos, it actually looks way better in real life. Although it's still not as aggressive as the previous generation, it's not that bad. So it actually looks better in real life, although I still prefer the front fascia of the older previous generation G63. And you can also see these huge AMG brakes with the red and AMG caliper. Alright, here's just a quick look at the new interior of the new G Class. As you can see. Alcantara headliner uses all the new materials and really uses the 10 centimeters wide core way better. Here's the close look at the headliner and uh, the reading light right here. These lights are here just so you can see the car better and not actually included in the normal car. All right, let's two standard. No, actually this one big cup holder, one small cup holder and that's it. Closer. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
So let's get out of the car. <laughs> The door still makes the proper closing sound. All right, not that.